Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. We are going to be working on a fun little drawing that goes pretty fast. This is called a scribble line drawing. Um, so, uh, what you're going to start out doing is get yourself a ruler. You want to have about a one inch border. I like to just trace the thickness of a ruler on my paper. Uh, makes it nice and easy to get that nice even border. All right, this is the fun part. Uh, the only thing you need to look out for is the edge of those lines there. You don't want to cross into your border um, with your scribbles. Um, and the scribbling part goes fast, let me tell you. Uh, you want to be careful how much scribbles you get down because you do want to leave some of the page open. Uh, what you're trying to do is um, compose at this point. You're trying to lay out these scribbles in a way that is going to be interesting to look at and create a little bit of movement and um, just be a nice little um, a nice little piece of uh, abstract art in the end here. Alright, so I'm just continuing to work those scribbles. I don't want to go um, too far with them, like I said, and a good strategy here, as you can see, is to use your ruler or some kind of shield or barrier. Um, when you get to those edges, then you can just um, bump your pencil right into that and get nice, clean edges there. All right, uh, I'll show you how I scribbled in the rest of this and with a nice, quick video here. Um, I do, I did put some scribbles down that went over the top the other direction, but. You really want to make sure um, when to stop there and not take it too far um, to where it's just a page of scribbles because afterwards you are going to trace around all of your little scribbly marks and make them look um, what I would um, describe as like very graphic. Okay, and in my case, all of my scribbles just about touch um, in, in, in most places, so um, this whole um, scribble drawing is, in my, in my case, is going to be connected as one um, large piece, but if you end up with like a scribble here, a scribble there, and they end up more as um, separate um, pieces, that is totally fine as well. Remember, this can go however you want. You can scribble a lot. You can scribble a little. Um, hopefully you'll kind of get a feel for when you want to stop and that's when you'll stop but um, you want to have a sort of a medium amount of scribbling um, I think my piece is probably bordering around the maximum amount that you'd want to have so I could have gone a little less okay when you finish with the outlining this is the next part you're gonna use these hatch marks and you're gonna go all the way around I started out in pencil and then jumped into my ultra fine point sharpie um, I thought that um, looked pretty nice. Afterwards, you're going to take your pencil and you're going to draw a little cast shadow all the way around in those holes and really give it that um, illusion that it's sitting on top there. Um, you clean everything up with the eraser and you are all set. Give it a signature and that's it.